What should agents be doing to prepare for the next market shift? A lot of people ask that and, and they, they read and they feed so much into what's happening in the economy. And I, I do believe that there's so many peaks and so many valleys in, 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 in several businesses, but real estate specifically, I see a lot of agents. And anyone who says they haven't really seen you know, a valley probably hasn't seen a peak. You know, let's be honest here. And so the way that I look at it is you can sit there and think, oh, the market's great, let me take advantage of the market's down. I say I can't control the market. That's one thing I cannot control. But there are a lot of things I can control. I can control my systems and processes, right? I can control the amount of relationships I build. I can control the service, I, 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 the, the level of service I provide to my buyers and sellers. Like there's so many things I can control where the outcome of those items are gonna be much, they're gonna much surpass what the market does, right? Guys, in 2008 and nine, and then when the big market took a crash, that was when I had my, some of my best years. And it was because guess what I did? When the market was hot in 2006, I was brand new in real estate. And so I was building up all these systems and processes. And so when all the top producers, their, their business went down, mine went up and because it wasn't because of the market, it was I controlled my outcome. And I think this, this, this video is all about control, right? Like what can you truly control in your business? Now, sometimes things happen, right? Yes, the sky falls and a roof falls down and you have to go put out a fire, great. You can't control that, right? You can't control if that happens. What you can control is how you communicate to your client about it, right? What you can control is, is, is how you uh, react to that. And so I'm in the react business when I have client fires to put out, but I'm in the actual sis consistent process C business when I see markets go up and down. And guys, there's gonna be a shift, right? And it's not gonna be the first, and I promise you it's not gonna be the last. But what I can tell you is, if you can find a way to, to sit down and control how you do business from a prospecting standpoint, from a relationship standpoint, from putting processes and procedures in place and delegating if you have a team, if you can control that, which you can guys, you are, you are ready, willing and able to do that, if you are, you'll win this, regardless if the market's high or low. I've seen it, I've done it, it's happened to me. If I was back in real estate right now, during the worst market, I'm telling you my business would thrive.